What's up guys, Australis here from Phantom Troop. Um, on my stream, I've been asked a few times on how do I mod my Wii U. And someone even just suggested just make a YouTube video on how to mod the Wii U. So here I am making a video on how to do it. Now I use Nairo's mod pack because I really like Nairo, I'm a big fan of him. Um, I highly suggest you guys subscribe to him, he's super fun to watch, one of my favorite streamers, one of my favorite Smash Bros players. Um, so I use his mod pack and he releases it to the public on his YouTube channel. Now it takes about 10 minutes to do, hopefully I can make this video under 10 minutes, if not, oh well, sorry guys. Um, but here's how to do it, you're going to need an SD card, a Wii U with an internet connection, and obviously a computer. So. You guys should be able to see my screen right here. Just go to uh, YouTube and go ahead and search Nairo. I'll do that for you guys. Nairo MK and go to his channel. Um, on his channel, go ahead and find the most recent mod pack. Now, right now, while this video is being made, January is the most recent mod pack. Ni er, February's should come out pretty soon, um, but January is the most recent one. Uh, just go to the description of this video. This is where you get the actual mod pack, okay? Before you do that, check out the mod credits. A lot of people went into a lot of work to make this mod pack. It's great. Um, let's definitely give the credit where it where it needs to be, all right? So um, right there is the guys who put in work to make this mod pack. So if you are in the United States, number one is the mod pack that you're going to want to download, okay? Just download that to your computer. If you are in Europe, um, you are going to want number five or six. Uh, I would recommend just five, but your Wii U must be set to the English language. Um, six would work and your Wii U can be set to any language. So my SD card is 16 gigabits. Um, uh, the EU one is a little bit bigger, 4.1, and the other one is 7.5 after unzipping. So go ahead and just download this and unzip it. If you don't know how to unzip something, uh, you're going to have to watch a different YouTube video on how to do that. I don't have time to show how to do that right now. That would make this a really long video, so you're going to have to do that. So download this and go ahead and insert your SD card into your computer so I'm going to insert the SD card here and you can see it pop up here now I've already downloaded it and put it on a different SD card so I'm not gonna do it this time but for those of you in Europe I don't know if there's different slang for an SD card I'm kind of out of touch like that so I do want to open my webcam here real quick and show you that this is an SD card, okay? Put the unzipped files onto this SD card, okay? So just go ahead and put it right here on the root of the SD card. Um, a good thing is it comes with all the contents of the mod pack, and the other thing it comes with is typed instructions on how to do this. So if you hate my video, then there is instructions on how to do it right there. So, put everything in this folder right here. Go ahead and eject your SD card and put the SD card into your Wii U. So I'm going to do that right now. Put it in my Wii U. Now I know my screen is ugly looking there. So I'm going to actually put on my Wii U. So my SD card is now in my Wii U. And what we are going to do is go to the web browser. So see under Pikachu there, the web browser, the world looking thing. We're gonna open that up. All right, and we're gonna go to a website. Now this website, it's kind of hard to pronounce, kind of hard to understand and things like that. So I will put the description in the video, but go to this website on your Wii U, not your computer, on the Wii U. Now this website is loadin.ovh, that's spelled L-O-A-D-I-I-N-E dot O-V-H. Go to this website. Now it looks like this. Um, up at the top you can see how it's spelled, Loadine Access Gate. 
Um, the website again is loadine.ovh. Um, open that up. Now you see the submit button right in the middle of the screen. If you go ahead and click the drop down on the left, you won't be able to see this because I can't stream my um, gamepad. But click that drop down and scroll halfway down and you'll see SD caffeine plus kernel. That will be in the description as well. So you'll know what to click. Click that and you can see it there in the middle now. SD caffeine plus kernel, okay? And just click the submit button. And it says, go back into the website right after the exploit to run uh, this program. And let's let the Wii U do its thing. Now we're gonna go right back in, all right? Click the internet browser again. Let's go right back in. All right, so we're gonna go to that website again. Load ein dot o v h. Click go. Now it says, "Look at your gamepad for the next instructions." So I'm gonna turn on my webcam because the gamepad looks sort of different this time, and it's a black, weird-looking screen. Just press A. That's all you gotta do. Press A, and it opens this back up like normal. All right. Now let's shut the webcam off so you don't have to look at my ugly face. Um, and just open the game like normal now. Click Wii U menu. Go ahead and open Super Smash Bros. And let's take a look at Nairo's Mod Pack. Now I can't remember if I said this earlier in the video, but every time you want to run your mods, you are going to have to go to that website. Insert your SD card, go to that website, and run the uh, kernel. I leave my SD card in my Wii U. It does no harm. Um, but you do have to run that every time. Your Wii U does not remember the mod pack. Um, so we're going to let this load up. On the SD card, if you ever want, put it back in your computer and you can read the instructions on how to do this. The instructions have the website. Uh, they have everything I've just done for you, but it's typed down. So let's open this up. Let's take a look at Nairo's January mod pack. All right, here it is. You can see the good old NRG Nairo logo here, uh, his January mod pack. Some cool characters on here. Um, there's a Cloud9 Mario, World Ally Mario. Um, I really like the World MK Leo. Um, some pretty sweet Mario. characters on here. Let's represent Ally. Let's just do a random here. Right, so that concludes it. This mod pack, it works great. I don't see any input lag, I don't see anything like that. Um, works great on Fagori, uh, local, things like that. So, uh, last couple things is if you do have questions, then go ahead and hit me up on Twitter. It will be on the description. And it'd be awesome if you guys went and checked out my Twitch stream. It is twitch.tv slash Corona Australis. I stream Tuesdays and Thursdays, 9 p.m. to midnight, Mountain Time in the U.S. So that's how you check it out. Um, you'll be able to see these mods in action on that stream, as well as Nairo stream. Go ahead and follow and subscribe to Nairo. Um, and I think the final thing is for my Europe fans that I got on my stream, it's the exact same way to do this. The only difference is which pack you download on the website. So. Um, that's all it is, so if you guys have any questions, come to my stream, ask in chat. I love to read the I love to read the chat. Or just ask me on Twitter. It'll be a good time. So thanks for watching. Uh, my name's Australis and I am out.